Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. Also, if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I always say welcome back, but like if some of you are new, welcome. <laughs> so in today's video, I'm going to be organizing my brand new desk. My boyfriend actually built this desk for me for my birthday. I am just so obsessed with it. Let me show you like a little view. I just threw some things on it because I was doing my makeup and I just wanted to like at least put something on it, you know? So I just put some like books and a lamp, but it is not going to stay like this. I'm going to be putting my makeup on those shelves, putting my mirror back up here, and just organizing it and making it a beautiful desk vanity area. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing today. If you've seen any of my makeup organizing videos, you probably know I keep my makeup in a dresser, so I'm happy to finally move it out and put some clothes in my dresser because I need more space for my clothes, so this just makes so much more sense. The first thing that I need to do is get more storage for my makeup. I don't want that metal thing out here. I think I want more of like stacked acrylic drawer drawers maybe. I like my pink bin that my lipsticks are in, my lip products. So I think I'm gonna keep that and then maybe try to find some acrylic drawers to put my makeup in. So I'm gonna go ahead and run to HomeSense first, I think, and hopefully find some type of makeup storage. So let's go. I do not know why I put lipstick on this morning. <laughs> exactly what I was looking for and a little bit more honestly but it's okay because I needed to get this stuff eventually so let me show you what I ended up getting I got this storage container which has these two drawers at the top and then the rest are like full-size bigger drawers I think that will be perfect to put like palettes in and maybe some other things and then this one is kind of like a smaller version of that but it has two drawers on the top and then two full-size ones on the bottom. Then I got these three wrapping papers for Christmas because I love Christmas shopping so much. I love wrapping presents. So, you know, there's one with like these little Christmas trucks on it. Then we got this natural paper with polka dot. Then this gold Christmas tree one. I just think they're so cute. And then the last thing are these little labels to put on the Christmas presents. Also, I think my family could use these as well. They come with so many, so this just makes it a little bit easier and they're super cute. But yeah, I'm so happy I found all of this at Home Goods. I think I said Home Sense at the beginning, but they are actually. I meant home goods and they are just exactly what I was looking for so I'm so happy I was like a one and done ran in ran out and I'm ready to set everything up so let's go ahead and organize some makeup. Okay, so in this bigger one down here, like I said, I'm going to do my palettes. And this video might be like a mini declutter as well because, I don't know, I just think it's good to go through your makeup every once in a while and see what you don't want, what's expired, what you want to give to a friend. I'm going to put my palettes in here and maybe get rid of some, I don't know. So this one, Smashbox Double Exposure, I don't use this and I got it a long time ago, so I think I'm gonna get rid of it. The rest I think I'm gonna keep though. I just got all of my palettes in these bottom two drawers. So this is like ColourPop and other smaller ones. And then down here, have the two Nabla ones, the Nabla side-by-side -side palette, my Kat Von D Beauty, I think it's called the Shade and Light palette. It's like all mattes. Then the Oh Hi Beauty one. Honestly, the Oh Hi Beauty one and the Nabla side-by-side -side palette and the Nabla Cutie palette, I'm still like deciding whether I want to keep or not. They just don't really excite me all that much. They're really beautiful, but I just don't think they excite me, 
I guess, if that makes sense. But I'm gonna keep them for now. And then I have two more of these drawers and then two small drawers to fill. So I'm gonna figure out what to put in those. Probably eyeshadows. Yeah, so, okay, let's see. Over here, we have some Glossier Sky Washes I can put in there, Glossier Lid Star. I gave my sister a lot of my Glossier Sky Washes. I think like two or three of them. She took them to London with her, but that's okay. I don't use them all that much. Got another Lid Star. Honestly, I want to declutter these kind of because I don't really use them, but I feel like I should have them in case one day they just magically work for me. And I have all of my little eye products over here should probably do like mascaras and eyeliner in those drawers as well so i'm gonna organize all these Okay, so in here I just have all of my other eyeshadow and eyeliner type things, some single shadows, some smaller palettes, and yeah. Maybe I should do like mascaras in one and then eyebrow products in another. I think that makes sense. And out of that whole thing, I only decluttered this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Yogurt. I'd never use this. And now I have my cheek products, my foundations and skin tints and stuff, my concealers, and some highlighters and bronzers. Yeah, I think in here what would make the most sense is base products and concealers, I think. Yeah, I think in my head that makes sense. I lost my cap to buy Pretty Fresh Tinted Moisturizer, which is really sad because every time I go to use it, I have to like pick out the dried part, so that's not fun. Okay, this L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear Foundation. I don't really wear foundation, but this is like one that I didn't dislike. I just kind of have it in case one day I do want to do something more full coverage. I think I'm just gonna keep it for now. I guess it's good to have a foundation. Glossier Skin Tint. I need to use that soon. I feel like it's been a while. Then my concealers. I'm gonna declutter the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop. This is old and I just don't use it. So there is my complexion drawer. This is really helping me just put my makeup into perspective and I really appreciate it. And also this just, I love how these are clear and I can see everything. Look how perfectly my mascaras fit in here. Isn't that so like aesthetically pleasing? I just love being able to see everything. This is just so much better. Now I'm gonna move on to this small one and do my cheek and just cheek products really. And then I have this one sole primer that I don't know what to do with. These M Cosmetics ones are thick. Hi, Nick. Hi. Come look at my storage. This is like exactly what I needed. Like these acrylic. Where'd you get those from? I went to Home Goods. Home Goods. And now I can actually put clothes in my dresser and it just like is so much nicer. Yeah, it looks good. Okay. And maybe we could do Glossier Cloud Paints in one or like cream. Oh, should I divide it? Cream and powder blushes? That's a kind of a cool idea. I did it, the tray is empty. I have some Glossier stuff though that I forgot about. Okay, these are lip products. And then I have this one sole face powder from Glossier. This is the Louder. Will this fit in here? Oh, perfect. Oh, this Tower 28. Okay, so this is the stuff that I'm going to declutter. I got rid of some stuff, which is good. I do need to go through this eventually. I do not know if it will be in this video. I think I want to do a whole video dedicated to just swatching my lip products and going through them and decluttering them. So I think I'm just going to leave this like this for now. Okay, so I just had a little lunch break and I'm ready to set up the rest of my desk, which is like the top part, the vanity part, I guess you could say. Also, I stole this little Christmas tree from downstairs because I wanted it in my room and hopefully my mom won't notice. So... <laughs> 
So the first thing that I need to do is put my mirror back on my desk because I really liked the way that that looked. I'm not sure if I want to hang it up or not. I think for now, I'm just going to prop it up on my desk because it gives it a more vanity feel. <laughs> I think I'm done. Well, all right, you guys, thank you so much for watching me set up my beautiful new desk. I am so beyond happy with how it turned out. It, I just feel so good knowing that my makeup is organized in those storage bins and I know exactly where everything is and it's out in the open. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love watching cleaning, organizing, setup type of videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. A huge thank you to my boyfriend if you're watching this for building this beautiful desk for me. I love it. <laughs> Make sure to check out all the links down below as always. I will try to find the storage containers I bought, but finding links from like home goods marshall's tj maxx is that's it's impossible basically but i'm going to try to find some links to similar storage containers for you guys but i don't know if i'm gonna get an exact match but you know check check your local home goods but yeah guys thank you so much for watching i hope you're having an amazing day wherever you are and i will see you in the next one bye guys <laughs>